just to get that tiny bit of experience. You know, I am going to need to get a lot more experience. Yeah, you're weak to fuck. She won't say anything. Hey, it's usually never back down from a fight, it's try to take advantage of one. And I plan on trying to take advantage of So hit the crown trail. Gather one. I just want to see what they give you, but they don't really give you anything. You, on the other hand... Oh, you're... You're gonna give me seventh, I'm fine with that. You look like you're... Um... Really? Hopefully everyone's having a good night. You well, you're going first, aren't you? Chrome Pass Checkpoint! And just start go a little bit more into this one. Man, we finally made it here. Up here. Was well, the Pass Checkpoint was supposed to be in the Ruan region, right? Yep. That's supposed to be what's on the other side. But unfortunately, it's almost sundown. Maybe we should ask them to let us stay here for the night. 
guess we could do that. Well, we also got the option to hurry down to the pass to the rest of the inn. And the rest of the inn at the foot of the mountain, right? Uh, crossing to the pass at night would be dangerous. With the field of vision limited, we would be on bad footing. It's also a possibility we could fall off a cliff if we were attacked by nocturnal monsters. I wouldn't recommend it. You're yeah, right. I guess it would. It could be pretty dangerous. Uh, looks like we uh, all we could do is explain our situation to the soldiers at the checkpoint. Northeast, Bow City. 441 Seld. Southwest, Ruan City. 669 Seld. 69. Minoria Village. 357 Seld. This is unusual. We don't get many travelers at this hour. Did you get lost hiking along the trail? No, not exactly. We're bracers, just so you know. Stealth sh shoulders the soldier her junior bracelet at home. Whoa, well, I'm supposed to see that someone your age is a bracer. So, what do you have to work then? So, are you here with work then? No, actually we're traveling around the kingdom to become senior bracers. And so we figured we'd travel on foot to get some training instead of using an airliner. You're going to travel around the whole kingdom on foot? Maybe it has to do with being young, but kids are certainly fired up these days. Teak. Maybe that's a bit of an un overstatement. But I'm going to have to tell you that trying to head down through the past night would be suicide. Basically, we've had untold mon number of monsters appearing in the area. It's quite peculiar, really. We've got a rest stop for travelers, so it would be best to stay there for the night. Sweet! Thanks a bunch! This is really... This will really help us out a lot. Don't mention it. Just... Wait, is his name Private Cuttinger? Huh. Interesting. Just talk to the Chief Warrant Officer when you're ready to hit the sack. He's at the guard station, straight ahead. Well, seeing how we got that here. We're rested and ready to go. Uh, since this place is such a high altitude, it gets really cold after dark. Private Mikey. It's almost time for me to go on duty. I'd better here up and eat while I can. Huh? And you were... We apologize for intruding at this hour. But we were actually wondering. Jasper explained the situation and asked if they could stay the night. Still try to make her eyes as large as in yearning. Oh god, I thought she said yeeting for that second there. Yeet! And she could in their hopes of scoring some free food as well. I see. Well, that's no problem. I can see from the event that you're bracers. Feel free to use the room next to here. We really appreciate this, sir. Huh? What are you kids hi doing hiking at, this at a time like this? It's pretty cold out there, huh? Ah, we're just gonna do that. Man, one of those beds has got blood on it. So, this is the room for travelers, huh? Do you see that? Like, in that corner? Yeah. Let's get that fireplace on, shall we? The fuck? Yeah, yeah we going eating. Ah, so nice and warm. Hmm. But you know, wood stoves just feel so much more cozy than these things. Yeah, I agree. Orbit stoves may heat up quickly. And they're certainly efficient, but they can compare with the feel of a real wood burning stove. True. 
but these ones are much easier to use. Hey, I'm sorry to bother you. I heard from the chief that you'll be staying tonight. If you need anything for dinner, we'll be happy to share what we have with you, if you'd like. Really? That would be wonderful. Thanks. No worries. After the airliners went into service, the number of travelers coming through were drastically decreased. Honestly, with all the free time we've got, we welcome any guests coming through here. Teehee. Well, in that case, we'll really make sure to eat up. Alright then. Now give us a little time to, to get the supper in order. And, uh, full disclosure here. I think it ushers, uh, it's ushers nice to cook. I hope your stomach's not delicate. Oh, wow, I've seen a lot for someone's stomach. Well, sure, there was a lot of rivalry going on over the Sky Bandit incident. But, there are quite a few nice soldiers once you start talking to them on a personal level. Yeah, that's true. So, hopefully, yeah, everyone's having a great night tonight. So, I know I have been, especially for today. Although, I think over. The girl is probably about the only place you're going to find the nice soldiers. Ah, what do you mean by that? Ah, don't take me too seriously. I was just thinking out loud. In the meantime, let's put our bags down somewhere. You are too? That's good, Purple Shell Queen. Oh man, I'm so stuffed. You said not to expect much. But the food was pretty good, don't you think? Uh, yeah, it was, uh... Certainly like nothing I've ever had before. Really? Well, that's good to hear, too. Excuse me for disturbing you. Oh, sir. The meal was delicious. Thanks so much. Yes, thank you. Uh, really? You must have taste buds of iron, too. Uh, I mean... Wow, I was like, oh yeah, your tongue's made of metal. I bet you have metal tongues for saying that. I mean, I'm glad to hear that you enjoyed it. Anyway, we've had another guest arrive, so if it's not too much trouble, could you two share the same room? Another guest? In the middle of the night like this? They must have... They must have some serious guts to be hiking around in the mountains at this hour. But no, we don't mind. It's not like we're paying to stay here either. I really appreciate that. He's actually in the same line of work as both of you, so I'm sure you'll get along just fine. Huh? Same line of work? Huh. I knew I'd seen you two somewhere before. Wait, Agate? You are? The Heavy Blade Agate? So, uh, oh. so you know each other already, huh? By the way, Agate, what do you plan to do about dinner? I appreciate the invitation, but I had something before coming up here. All I need is someone to crash for the night. Understood. Go ahead and divide up the beds amongst yourselves. Alright, good night. Yeah, three beds, three of us. How convenient. Now, if I remember right, weren't you Cassius kids? What are you doing sleeping in a place like this? And what happened to Sheriff's Herd? Sheriff sure returned to Rollins, and now it's just the two of us traveling together. We're thinking of making our way around the kingdom in order to become senior bracers. We're going to see the places we want to protect and train so that we can just do that. Senior Bracers? Traveling the entire kingdom on foot? You two are really a bunch of carefree brats, aren't you? Oh, you're trying to piss her off. Probably not the best of ideas. What did you just call us? 
there's no way the two of you are simply there's no way the two of you are simply going to become senior bracers you're going to simply become senior bracers use your brains and think about it for a moment say what you want but we helped in the arrest of sky bandits and we've even got some recommendations so quit treating us like we're a bunch of kids oh that I heard all about it from old man Lugrin. All right. Let me put it to you this way. Suppose you have been the only ones here. Do you think you could have solved the incident? Just you two alone? Without Shirazar's help? Well... I think it would have been very difficult. Now that's pretty obvious when you think about it, huh? You two are newbies and little brats. To say the least. Not to mention, you're lacking strength and experience. So, don't have the ability to make quick, sound judgments. If you get all caught up in yourselves and forget that, one of these days you're gonna get the fuck pulled out from under you. We're not all caught up in ourselves. How about yourself, Mr. Macho Man? Oh, yeah, dig it. Snap into a slim gym. Oh, yeah. What were you thinking trying to hike through the pass at this hour of the night? You're either plain careless, or maybe that banana is just a little too tight. Watch your mouth, brat. I'm trying to hone my skills, unlike you amateurs. And besides, I'm here for work. Don't try to compare my actions with your tourist training. Work? For the guild? Yep, that's right. The work your old man forced on me. Huh? Dad pushed his work onto you? Hmm. Forget about it. I've got an early day ahead of me. So, I need to get some rest. You two to quit talking and get some sleep, too. Hey, streamer. Cast Hydrate. Okay, I will after this uh, conversation's finished. Ah. You just avoided finishing the conversation. Well, he did drop a tidbit about Dad. That's something, at least. Enough already, you two. Just shut the hell up and let me sleep. Wow. Thanks, Kitty, for, for doing that hydrate. And you better stop poking around where you shouldn't, or you're going to get burned. Instead, why don't you get your behinds over to Iran and do some jobs listed on the bulletin board? That's... <sighs> Far better suited for the likes of you. And he's out. Uh, hey! It looks like he's asleep. Just as quickly as someone I know. Don't you even dare suggest that I'm like. I'm anything like this jerk. What's his deal, anyway? Uh, it seems to me like he's trying to do is pick a fight. All he's trying to do is pick a fight. Relax, Estelle. It's true we're still just novices at this. Yeah, it could be that he's just... It could be that he just said that to us because he was worried about us. Do you really think so, Joshua? I wish I could say for sure, but I don't know. He definitely... To get on one thing, right... We should turn in for the night. We've still got to hike down through the pass tomorrow. I'm all riled up now, but I guess there's nothing to be done about it. Unless we do let this jerk's face and then go to sleep. I'm pretty sure he wouldn't wake up with the way he's snoring. Don't even think about it. Meanwhile, I'm just going to walk in place. Sorry to keep you waiting. I'm ready to take over for you. 
Oh, is it that time already? It really makes me wonder if anyone really needs to stand a character with nobody coming through here. Don't you think it'd be better if we just kept the gate locked in all night? Unfortunately, rules are rules, and it's our job to follow them. We just got over the Sky Bandit mess, and now things seem to be going downhill. Hmm? What's the matter? Did you hear something? It sounds like some rustling leaves. You sure it's not just a wind? Yep, that sounds like the wind, all right. Oh shit, there's like six of them. What? A pack of wolves. You've got to be kidding me. What was that? Sounds like something's going on. I'm going to check it out. You two stay here. Uh, now just you wait a minute. I think we better go see for ourselves, just in case. Of course that's what we're going to we do. Okay. Whoa, they're pushing them back, too. Wolves! This is bad news. We better hurry and back them up. Hey, forget it, you kids. Why are you trying to stop us from helping? You call yourself a bracer? Don't get me wrong. It's just... It's just that it's the enemies you have to protect... Chip point. Not yours. These guys are well trained. So they should be able to take care of them in no time. You'd just be giving it away. But I'm pretty sure we could... It's just as Ricky says. This is our job. We'll get back inside, you three. What? Crap! What the heck is going on here? Still, the other side! It seems like something happening on the Ruan side of the checkpoint. What? Oh, yeah. We're gonna have to get into this one. I incredible! He's even stronger than the rumors suggest. Yeah, we're just gonna surround you now. You just took out one of our guys. Huh. So you intend to surround me, huh? You're pretty clever for a bunch of mucks. We've got you covered! Hey, get back inside! Hmm. You can't stop us from helping you out. We'll try to help you out without getting in the way. Fine, whatever. Just make sure not to get caught beneath my heavy blade. Let's dance! Alright. So what have we got? Attack Dobermans. A disciplined monster that moves in packs. Quickly corners prey with speed and fangs. No such big weakness. Probably the one to attack first. What do you got? Stone Hammer, Aqua Bleed, and that. that's what's here. So. Maybe should I just attack? Okay, still... Man, it's a good thing I got there. Okay. Down. You're the one with 98, but you're the one that... I do not want you getting that. Probably going to attack. Yeah, 
No, it's still good in here. Okay. That was a waste. Twenty-two. Yeah, at least we got a lot of other stuff for it. Phew! It looks like we managed to take care of them all. Yeah, there are a lot of them. They were pretty formidable. Mm. Looks like you handled yourselves better than I would have expected. But then again, maybe it's a, only natural that you learn the basics from your old man, huh? Don't get me wrong. I mean, you did well for newbies. You still hike of a long way from becoming senior bracers, though. Hey, was everything okay over here? Yeah, it's all good. We took care of every last one of them. How's your injured guy? Luckily, he, just, he suffered a... A few minor cuts and bruises. I'm just glad you happen to be here. I should have expected much from the heavy blade agate. I did do much. And these kids here didn't do half bad job either. Is that so? Well, thanks to you two then. Uh, sure. Well, we intend to patrol the area just in case. How about you guys get inside and get some rest? We'll do that. But you be careful. Alright. I guess it's time for me to get back to bed. We shouldn't have to worry about any uh, other dangers tonight. So you two be good kids and get some sleep. Am I imagining things, or did he just give us a compliment? He may have recognized our ability. He has a lot more straightforward than we made him out to be. Maybe he's a lot. Maybe he's a lot more straightforward than we made him out to be. Um, hey, I don't know about that. I'm gonna go to bed, okay? Cause I gotta get up very early. Yes, we know. Again. Love you, my baby doll. Love you. Ah, gorgeous doll. He certainly talks big. That's for sure. Mm. All right, go on. One Love more, one more, Keith. Okay. Love you. Night, everybody. You're not gonna say that as well. Still, still, wake up. Oh, come on. Can't a woman have her beauty sleep? Huh? Joshua? Is it already time to go to the guild? What are you talking about? This is the Chrome Pass checkpoint. Oh, right. We had that monster scare last night and... Huh? Where'd the red-headed jerk go? It looks like he took off early this morning. Apparently he had an urgent job to attend to. Oh. And after he helped him fend off those monsters last night too. How rude of him not to say anything before leaving. It's not that big of a deal, Estelle. How about we get ready ourselves? I'd like to make it through the pass by noon. No, oh, all right. So off to run we go. Yeah, she gets dressed. We hit the rest button. Good morning. Were you able to sleep well? Thanks for lending us a hand like you did last night. That must have got me good. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning to yourselves as well. 
Thanks for helping us out the way you did last night. Tee <laughs> Well, we didn't do much. How about you guys? Did you run any, into any trouble patrolling the area after that? Oh, everything was fine. Uh, like on any normal night. I'll tell you what, though. That was rather strange. Strange? What was? You know how the lights along the roads at and at the checkpoints have the ability to ward off monsters, right? Well, even if there were monsters that approached the checkpoint, there wouldn't be any more than two or three in number. So yesterday was the first time I ever seen him come in a large pack like that. Yeah. That is rather strange now that you mention it. But then again, these monsters were a small change when compared to the Imperial Army. We should probably just consider it's good training and protect our base of operations. Is that really the issue we're here? Us? That's all we're really concerned about. Protecting the checkpoint is paramount. Really figuring out what the monsters were thinking up to the new bracers. Now, getting back on topic. You guys are heading over to the Wuhan, right? Are you ready to fill out the paperwork for your gate pass? Yes, thank you. So, I'll just fill out the paperwork to enter the Wuhan region. Well, that's that. Looks like you're done here. Enjoy your travels in Wuhan. The warrant officer operated the gate. Welcome to the Wuhan region. Blue oceans and white magnolias are we too. That reminds me, you'll be heading to Wuhan City, right? A lot of dropping stuff, apparently. Yep, that was the plan. Why? Well, just make sure to report the guild concerning the incident that happened up here last night. There will be a payment there from the army for helping us out. Really? Yeah, but you're going to have to divvy your spoils with Agate. Alright. Enjoy yourselves and good luck in your endeavor to become senior bracers. Thanks. We really appreciate everything you've done for us. And now that's done.